thumb stuff. <laughs> um, I, it is my great pleasure to introduce Sandra Singlo, who, um, because she said uh, she has a potty mouth on Sunday mornings, um, she got me a, a gig at KCRW that uh, pays, you nothing. Know, pays nothing. I just spent it at the bar. Um, <laughs> uh, but she is a professional, and we do need a professional right now. Sandra. Thank you so much. Since these fans, as you've seen by this evening, can sometimes seem like a, a rogues gallery of frightening people. <laughs> Folks sometimes ask me why I, a freedom-fighting public radio Democrat living in Van Nuys, remain such a friend and fan of Kathy. And it is because, unlike so many LA female writers, Kathy is truly a sister. <laughs> can I hear for the sisters? <laughs> Woo! Time for the women. Woo! Sisters, yeah, and not in the faux feminist Naomi Wolf way. Thank you so much. Uh, but in the real way, she's non 310 area code, non west of the 405, pro public school, except for that Florence O'Donnell thing, whatever that was. It was really his fault. That was a charter school he's in. We know that Canyon Charter. And aside from that, I have to say I'm truly inspired because aside from being a very polite party host, um, she's a great mother. And I can yes. see my two daughters have come here. And yes, they've heard all the obscenities of, that the men said today. Really good training for that. But we'll talk about it. Um, I mean, just look at the great genes and training that Kathy and Jerry have passed on to Maya. Maya, who is already scandalizing. Give me a little applause. Give me a little applause Maya. This is the last of the blogging world. I mean, look at this. She's she's amazing. Maya, who has already come out the gate racing through, she's already scandalized the nerdy dad blogger world by <laughs> daring to get a GPA and SATs, not in the choleric, skinny tail end of the bell curve, <laughs> but in the meaty part. <laughs> the meaty red state part of the bell curve. And winning admission to UC San Diego. <laughs> Russian studies, Russian studies, one year early. I'd like us to raise a toast to Maya. Yeah. 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 And uh, good luck to UC San Diego. <laughs> <laughs> and really, that's about it. Kathy, would you like to just say a little, little thank you, closing, little warmth, thank you. little love? Yeah. Okay, little love from the Sipster. Um, obviously, thank you all so much, and I'm, I'm amazed at the people who came here tonight and got up to speak, and I mean, one, I guess we all sort of have strange fantasies of these little Tom Sawyer events, and uh, that really, although nobody wants to say it, I guess that's what this kind of is, but I would say one thing that happens that I've noticed when you become sick is, is you get to see people as they really are. It's almost as if...